was a major victory for dreamers and supporters of the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals Act today. In a 5-4 to four ruling, the U.S. Supreme Court justices blocked the Trump administration's efforts to end the program. It protects undocumented immigrants who were brought here as children. The court found the administration didn't provide a good enough reason to end the program. Chief Justice John Roberts wrote the president does have the power to end DACA, but he didn't do it right this time. And here in Tallahassee, the ruling has many feeling calm for the first time in months. We spoke with a DACA recipient who's been here since she was four years old. Maria Torres tells us before this, she was living on edge, fearing the block would separate her from her family. A sense of relief, you know, because uh, it was all just what are we going to do if it does get blocked and um, if, you know, if it's denied and um, all our normal activities, our, our whole life is established here. I live here with my family, all of which are all, you know, residents and U.S. citizens. Immigration lawyer Elizabeth Ritchie calls it a step in the right direction. In order for things to really be safe for Dreamers, Ritchie says it's up to Congress to come up with a permanent solution.